Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my channel. This layout is for Dolly's 2000 Subby Subscriber Hop. And I am scrap lifting this beautiful layout that she did. I just love her layouts. And she is such a wonderful friend. She is also part of the Mini Kit Monday Gals. And anyway, please go to her channel. She is having a $50 gift card uh, giveaway. So go check out her channel. See what she's doing today. See what kind of layout she is creating. Also, below are some links to everybody playing along. There's going to be so many layouts that you get inspiration from. I just love this. Now, my camera is moving. I am really sorry, but it got bumped and it was kind of crooked. And then all you could see is the floor. You know how it is. Now, I am using my scraps from the Sawyer workshop kit and I'm using this thin cut. It's the circle shaker pocket. And I just cut a couple rings, and it looks like she has a couple, like, in the top left and the bottom right. So that's what I'm doing. And then there's a strip up at the top with the banner sticking out. And, yeah, I do pretty much everything but use a different uh, paper line. And I stamped out these flowers. <clears throat> Oh, it's early in the morning, and I have that frog in my throat. I sleep with a fan on, and every morning I have to clear my throat, and <laughs> and that is the time when I do my voiceovers. Now, I have two of these uh, circles die-cutted out off-camera. One of them has the branding strip, the one on the left here. Um, has a little piece of white. I had every intention when I seen that. I thought, well, I'll stick that underneath my photo. Nope. I forgot it was there and didn't realize it till I was laying it down here. Now, I do end up covering it up with the flower. I'm using some of these chipboard pieces that came in the Sawyer workshop kit. And I'm piecing together the rainbow. <clears throat> I My granddaughters love rainbows. And I love using them in my layout. On their layouts. Just kind of fun. <laughs> oh, you know what? I have that heart. And I forgot to put it on my page. It had to have fallen off. <laughs> I really like uh, bringing that blue down. She has a blue jean jacket on. And um, <clears throat> that's why I'm using some of the harbor polka dotted paper up top. And then I'm bringing a little scrap down on the bottom just to help carry in some of the blue. I love how I could bring in the grape and the mulberry and the wisteria purple colors into this layout. Now this stamp gives you a few leaves or petals that you can put together to make a flower or I am just sticking them in for extra petals. And I do end up pop dotting uh, that flower up. Now I want to lay this here and kind of see where I want it. This layout really come together quick by using Dolly's layout and and it was just so cute and easy i hope that you find a layout of hers and scrapbook it and um she has lots of wonderful ideas don't forget go check out her channel and everyone's links listed below plus i will have the sawyer workshop kit plus the uh, sawyer stamp and thin cuts that i used on my page also, um, shimmer brushes that I bring in. And what else did I use? Um, the shaker pocket, uh, the circle shaker pocket thin cuts. I will have those linked below too. 
So if you want to come by and pick them up, I'd love to have you as a new customer. Now these are the little circles that came in the workshop kit that I didn't get used up. I wanted to bring some more of the blue up around the photo just to help make her photo pop. So I like that, but I think it's too white. So I pulled a color of a grape cardstock from close to my heart and I trimmed down my edges on my layout. And now I'm going to have a purple outline, which I think it helps bring all my elements to life. Okay, I'm going to use Sapphire and just give it a sprinkle around my page. And I hope you enjoy this. And don't forget to congratulate Dolly. I am so happy for you, girl. And go check out her channel. And here are some close-ups. And thank you so much for coming to watch my channel. Bye-bye.